Ladies and gentlemen, he's back after a brief hiatus. He is the man that brings the word to the big bird. It's the people's lemur. Now here is your host. He is the man, the host of the show, the people's lima, Eric Lima. Thank you. Thank you so much for that wonderful announcement and welcome back to another episode of the people's lima. I am your host, Eric Lima, the people's lima. <laughs> That's me. I'm back. I gotta start working on my introductions. I suck. I'll admit that. You know, sometimes this is a. As I'm still trying to get used to this YouTube thing. You know, I'm not gonna be a big star if I did great. If not, so what? It's been a crazy, ah, crazy, crazy summer. I mean, it goes nuts and out of my mind. And whoop! That way, um, a lot, a lot has going on. I'm really excited. Um, new Super Mario Brothers 2 is coming out for the Nintendo 3DS. And I am considering upgrading my DS Lite. And that's what I'm going to do. Plus, uh, so I'm, I'm, may, may, I'm going to go for it. Also, The Expendables 2, starring just about every action hero there is, except for Steven Seagal, The Rock, and Jackie Chan. Uh, excluding those three, you know, you, you know the guys talking about John claude Van Damme, Jet Li, Jason Statham, Sylvester Stallone, Bruce Willis, Arnold Schwarzenegger, Chuck Norris, and Dolph Lundgren, and Terry Crews. They're all in it tomorrow. It's opening up tomorrow. I can't wait. I'm looking forward to that. Um, Impact Wrestling's on right now. A lot's going down. We have new general managers at the 1,000th episode. It was pretty awesome. The 1,000 episode of Raw was awesome. We have AJ as our new general manager of Raw, while Booker T's remain the new general manager of SmackDown. So it'll be very interesting to see how the situation goes and how to go about it. So it's going to be uh, going to be a good. <clears throat> it's going to be a very good thing. Work for me has been doing pretty good, and I had to travel around with the maintenance guys to help sweep up the parking lot because we have no sweeper. But hopefully by the end of this month and by midweek, that will change. So fingers crossed on that. Um, family's going to cook out, celebrations, whatnot. The Wellness City Festival was off the chain. Once again, I enjoyed it. I had a great time there. And <clears throat> it'll be very interesting. Summer Slam, you're talking about um, a triple threat match, Cena. Punk, defending champion, the Big Show, Intercontinental title, the Miz became the new Intercontinental champion, defeating Christian in the 1000th episode of Raw. So we talking about uh, him against Mary Mysterio. AJ made the matchup, and uh, NXT is now brand new with the most, the more develop, uh, develop, um, development of the FCW stars. They decided to have an NXT website. Is it FCW Wrestling Info? Check that out. Check that white website out. If you want me to send you the link, I'll be more than happy to if you comment on this video. But if you know that's alright, I'm still gonna send you the link if you if you're curious about it. Just let me you know. This FCW is probably is, stars features of tomorrow, and it's been hot for the last few days here. It's been a little hot, well, up to the 85, probably the mid 80s, and I'm really excited about that. The Red Sox are not doing doing very well. I hate to say it, but the football season is almost on the way. That's why I got my Pat shirt on. The, Aaron Hernandez t-shirt jersey. I'm looking forward to uh, that. Uh, gee, what, oh, what the heck? Is, what else is going on? What else is going on? A lot of stuff. Lots of stuff. Lots of stuff. I'm telling you. Lots of stuff. TNA's got um, on right now. Uh, Aces and Eights. Be very interested to see what happens. Uh, uh, was it? Hardcore Justice is over. So. <coughs> And, and um, just uh, <laughs> uh, what else? What else? What else? A lot, a lot of stuff. A lot of crazy things. A lot of crazy, crazy stuff going on here. I'm loopy, and if I mumble my words, I apologize. It's been, like I said, a crazy month, and uh, I'm totally looking forward to what the fall has. And you know, be very inter interesting. I. I just, I just found out that I'm due for an upgrade on my new phone in which we ordered my new free phone. I'm really excited. Cannot wait to try it out to see what develops here. So I'm just, uh, yes, you know, <laughs> woo -woo. you know, my picture of Dolph Ziggler as a Beverly brother, along with the Beverly brothers, appeared on Zack Ryder's YouTube show. It's the last show, episode number 79. 
check it out on Z Two Gonna Lie on the Story on on WWE Fan Nation. Go to their YouTube channel. Check it out. I'm honored, Zachary. Thank you, sir. I appreciate that. And just I figured, you know, with him and Dolph Ziggler gonna fight out in WrestleMania 29. Why not? Why not make it appropriate? You know, some jabs at Dolph Ziggler. Ziggler is a heck of a wrestler, a heck of a competitor. People say push him, push him, push him. There's a lot of superstars out there. And according to sources, they say the Triple H is going to be more focused on the tag team division than in the Divas division. So, it's like no more. So, could we don't see no more Divas recruiting. And if they it, it did going to hire any Divas, it should be former Divas. In my personal opinion, Molina needs to come back to the WWE. I think they made a mistake letting her go. They made a mistake letting Mickey James go. But they should run over to TNA if somehow... TNA decides to let Mickey go and do her thing. I'm sure she'll come back to the WWE, but we'll see. We'll see what happens. Matt Morgan's rumored to come to the WWE. We'll find out what happens there. And uh, Felix Hernandez, congratulations. I'm a Red Sox fan, but Felix Hernandez and Seattle Manners pitched a perfect game yesterday. First ever put perfect game in Seattle Manners history. In fact, the Seattle Manners are the first team to get a perfect game thrown at them by Philip Humber of the White Sox and have have their pitcher pitch a perfect game this season. It's in one season long. The Tampa Bay Rays have been not doing well in perfect games. They've been, been shut down three times in those kind of situations. First team to do that this year. So I'm very interested to see what's going on now. And if the Red Sox go, I, don't, I think regardless, if the Red Sox play, make the playoffs or don't, and I highly doubt they will make the playoffs, their offseason is going to be a lot of house cleaning. I can guarantee you that. That's my personal opinion on that subject. So say no more. So that's all for the that's all for the time for half of the show. We're gonna watch Impact Wrestling. Jeff Hardy just came out to uh, to Austin Aries who's in the ring. So it'll be very interesting to see how this works. This Bound for Glory series is gonna continue. Who's gonna win? Don't know. You know what? It'll be very interesting. So uh, so stay cool, stay solid. You know, keep cool. Get get an air conditioner going. Get fan going. Don't sweat too much. Don't go every single time. You know, if you have to do that, that's fine. But get a fan, get an air conditioner, it'll work out well. All right. Be cool, my be cool, my peoples. Peace out. Love you. God bless. Later.